just family, but many time by here and enjoying beautiful nightlife at Jam Rock Restaurant here at Oak Plaza on Spintex Road. Enjoying paradise in Ghana, and it is beautiful. Beautiful thing, beautiful energy. Yeah. On the way up to get a nice red, not red, but a uh, nice uh, rum punch. But yeah, this is what you see nice and red. So there you go, family. That's what, that's what you see nice and red. Our beautiful sister always smiling. Oh, she gives me a kiss saying, hey, welcome to Jamrock. Come and enjoy. So yes, family, going to get me a classic rum punch. And enjoy the vibes and energy here. How's it going, brothers? How's it going, brother? Yes, brother. Everything cool. Everything nice, man. Everything yes, nice. You see, you get a nice rum punch. Yes, my brother. <laughs> hey, my it. brother, you a vlogger? Yeah, absolutely. Bomani Tayamba. Eh? Live and revolutionary. Bomani Tayamba. Bomani, yes, Bomani Tayamba. That's a warrior. Warrior? Yeah, Which absolutely. Language? Which language? Uh, different uh, version from West Africa to Southern Africa to even East Africa and Tanzania. You know, it's a popular name that means, you know, warrior. Ah, and where things. Are you from? I don't mean from, to disturb your video. No, it's all your brother. All good. <laughs> Origin from Kingston, Jamaica. Grew up in Brooklyn. Originally from Kingston, Jamaica. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 We're from Jamaica. We're from Jamaica. Jarrett Lane. Jarrett Lane. Jarrett Lane. Yes. Uh, we left. We left. We left. Nineteen eighty-eight. Gilbert. Come on, come on, New York. December nineteen eighty-eight. You're from Jamaica. Yeah, you guys, you guys, at first you know, I was like, you know, these guys have some real good accents. <laughs> but then I was like, you know, these are yard man. These are yard man. You know, so you have to listen for a while, yeah, and, and things like that. So, yeah, well, you know, we've been bringing the vibe of just connecting our people from the diaspora, yeah, man. including J Jamaica, right here to Ghana. Ghana is one of the flagship countries. Yeah, man. So, you know, you know, I have a group over there, you know, we bring groups, roots and coastal tours. Ah, so, oh, yeah, we Right here, so. Yeah, so I bring groups here. I've been, you know, I'm one of the ones, a pioneer of the repatriation movement. I'm trying to get black people for the diaspora to organize themselves, put their money together, and move to, you know, move to Africa and things. Yes, absolutely, man. So you guys, you you're, you're grew up in uh, America, Europe. Uh, I know you don't think you're from Jamaica, do you? Yes. This man from Jamaica last week. Last week. Last week. So you from Jamaica, Jamaica from the Ghana. Last week. Last week. Last week. Last week. Last week. <laughs> I'm two years ago, people from Jamaica. So you never live in America? You never live in America. Never live in America. So yes, it's a different. So, so yeah. people like myself, you know, like some of them, you know, you have the UK accent, the UK accent with a Jamaican. And then, so people like myself, America, maybe Africa, and no, Jamaica mix into the accent a little different. And you know, you guys are straight from yard. Straight from yard. Yeah, so, so you can see the, the difference in the accent. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I love the American for me. <laughs> and then I have a good brother named Taz. You know, you hear the British energy. Ah. I believe you tell a yard man. <laughs> so it's just unique, man. But it's just, it just represents us as a global people. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. That, that, you know? And so we have our t-shirts that say, inspired by Marcus Garvey. Oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah that's, 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 that's the plan, man. That's, that's the goal, you know? Yeah. I hope you guys are fine because you know you're being recorded live. Yeah, man. Where your boat, man? Where your friend? Where your people? Where your channel? Yeah. Bomba ni chamba. Bomba specialized in Africa tours and investment. I live up in China. I can't say the word. Bomba ni. Bomba ni. I can't say. Go follow and subscribe. Yeah, man. Subscribe to that channel. That's incredible, man. That's another side of story. Jamaicans coming straight from Jamaica. Yeah, man. So every Jamaica I know literally live in either America yeah, or live in Europe, Europe and then come to Africa or do something else. Yo, man, let's look at you. We are ahead of the curve. That's, <laughs> that's a new generation of new yeah, 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 yeah. Marcus, the way you're doing is Marcus, you already envisioned that, man. Black yeah, people living directly from the Caribbean and that's going right to Africa. Yeah, yes, man. Yeah, and and by, bypassing the traps of Europe and America. Well, you know, my brother, I feel like, I feel like Africa and Africans and Caribbeans can share both places. I mean, Africans can move to the Caribbean freely as well. Freely. Or shoot. Wait up, bring the cabin and that's nice strong rum punch. 
should move to the Caribbean. You know what I mean? They should, you know what I mean? We exchange people. Yeah. Is it me? Some people sure. can live in the Caribbean, some people can live in Africa. Is the body because it's black people anyway. Yeah, you have to, you have yeah to, Jamaica to, you have is like ninety nine percent black people. Yeah, the, the biggest thing we try to push is black ownership. Yeah, yeah, because you know the north, the north coast of Jamaica is one of the most incredible coasts. There's no place on the planet like the north coast of Jamaica. Yeah. And if you really think about the most the fanciest resorts and the richest people that ever build resorts, they're all right there. From, from the grill, Montego Bay, Ultra Rio, Sport and Corner. They tell the people that now, people like myself, we never get a chance to put the money together to build anything in Jamaica. We're getting land in Africa now, so we're dealing with land and then developing yeah, land by the beach and things like yeah, that. Man. Yeah, man. So I mean, it's, it's a new vision. But it's a vision, you know what I mean? We have to get the people from Africa to buy some land in Jamaica as well. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, we get Jamaica to buy land in Africa. You have, a, you have a nice Nigerian energy in Jamaica right now. Yeah, oh yeah? After all of our people just run all over the place, Europe and America, Nigerians coming in there. Build business and, yeah, man, do, 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 and then do well for themselves. So you ask our people, what's wrong with us, man? We're, we're running all over the place, and other people are coming and they're building business. Just like the Chinese and the Indians. And that's why I come, because I say if Chinese come and build, <laughs> I can't. Why we can't come? Why we can't build? Yeah. Yeah. There you go, man. Real talk. Yeah, we're being we're black. <laughs> it's our place. Nobody knows where we are. Not that they are until we talk. Yeah, absolutely until you talk. <laughs> <laughs> Until you start, right? Even today, somebody was saying to Israel, he looks like a guy. Yeah, then you know, sometimes you may say a man looking, you, know, you think your man looks in like New York. <laughs> there are popular places. But yes, friend, we're going to cut the speed short so I have a drink and jam my brothers. But let me jam rock. I'm <laughs> 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 